I think I just got salmonella by looking at this place. Gotta keep the public from dropping in for a cone. Good point. I'd say their cover is working beautifully. Okay. You'll need to come up with a good reason to be here. Hmm. Looks like they're scheduled for server maintenance and security upgrades this month. That might get you in. I think I can smooth talk my way past them. Don't play games, Mike. These guys are trained to spot double agents and imposters. If their post is compromised, they'll shut it down and we'll lose our access. You'll also need to give the correct handshake code to identify yourself as an agent. Secret handshakes? What are we, the Shriners? It's a specific passphrase that rotates on a monthly basis. You give the correct phrase, they give the correct response, and you both know everything's on the level. So what's the code? Tell them that the Adirondacks are beautiful this time of year. They should respond with, yes, but the Alps are lovely all year long. Got it. Let's see if anybody's home. Can I help you? I'm here to fix the computers. We don't have a problem with the computer. I hear the Adirondacks are beautiful this time of year. I don't like the mountains. And you're here to fix the computers. He didn't give the response for his something's wrong. Uh, yeah. Say, about those Adirondacks. I told you I don't like mountains. Come on. I'll show you the computers. That's not the response phrase. Stay on guard, Mike. If my code is out of date, they might suspect you're not on the level. So, my friend, what do you need? I need to access your Echelon server pursuant to Section G817, subparagraph B. Section... Uh... G817, eh? Subparagraph B. Time is a factor here. Uh, well, uh... Okay, then. So, no more computer troubles, eh? You should be all set. Fort Meade can rest easy now. Hey, my friend! Gone to go? Yep. Got a good view of the estate where this meeting is supposed to take place. What now? Albar is our target. He's supposed to be here tonight. Oh, I'm glad I brought this rifle. But what's the deal with the scope? It can transmit images to me in real time. Aim at someone, and I'll run their picture through the database. See if we get a match. The longer you focus on a target, the quicker I can make an ID. The ID is all I need. And if the target's a scumbag, I take him out? That's your call. If you decide to shoot, just make sure you don't do it if the target's inside of a camera or another person. We don't know who Albar is meeting, so taking anyone else out may have repercussions, depending on who their friends are.
owns a sports car dealership in Naples. Does a lot of international business, but no criminal record. Not our guy. Roman artist. Made a name for himself last year with a controversial exhibit in Paris. Some local juvenile offenses, but otherwise he's clean. Not our target. And nobody. Looks like the guards are clear. Moving up to the next position. In position. All right, let's begin. Security guard. He's clean. Well, she's a little underdressed. Definitely a cold night from the looks of it. All right, Mike. Dutch flower baron. He's suspected of dipping into the drug trade. But that's all I've got. Nothing really incriminating. Private security. Ex-special forces. Not our man. But definitely a professional. He planned and led the assault that took back the hijacked British jet last year. I remember reading about that. Should I get an autograph for him? celebrity talk show host. He's a known meth user, but nothing related to financing terrorists or arms smuggling. I'm in position overlooking the chateau. A lot of guests tonight. I see. Might be very... Careful, I know. I don't want a mob after me before we have a target. right now on corporate involvement in the Middle East. Is any good? I'm waiting for the movie. Anyway, nothing on him. He's a cop in Rome. Must be moonlighting as a bodyguard for one of these guys. serves on the board of directors for the Christian Islamic Confederation. <laughs> He's practically a saint. Keep looking. Albara, that's him. Take him out. Hold on. A lot of State Department and Interpol records. State Department says he's dirty. Interpol says his finances are legitimate, though. And... Mina, do I take him out? None of these State Department records are sourced. I can't tell where they came from, or when. Best I can tell, their intel was added to his sheet a few months before you left for Saudi Arabia. He's a member of al Samad, right? I don't know. I'd say yes. But, but I might be wrong. You can take him out or we can abort. It's up to you. I'm aborting the mission. All right, Mike.
What's that beeping noise? Thank <laughs> you. 